So with all this heading my way, <laughs> did anyone ask me why on January 12th of my senior year, I shoplifted six video stores in one night? In one night, instead of working hard to prove what a terrible criminal I was, did anyone consider I might also have been a young man having a hard time and needing some help? Did anyone sit in a circle with me and say, Brandon, Marlo, Wainwright, what were you thinking? Six stores in one night? You must have known you was gonna get caught. For a few thousand dollars, you threw away a hundred thousand dollar full ride college scholarship. You're gonna be part of that 10%. Why, Brandon? No, <laughs> they didn't ask. They charged me with robbery. They kicked me out of school. They made an example out of me. Nobody <laughs> acknowledged that I had to be the best at being Brandon Wainwright, star athlete, star student to make that 10% and to thrive. And that I had to be the best at being dub. Dub. <laughs> to have shelter, food, and survive. They didn't acknowledge that I was locked in a terrible split that put surviving and thriving at war with each other. They acted like Brandon, the high school vice president of the future business leaders of America, was a lie. <laughs> that I had finally shown my true colors. Black. As if I was by nature essentially a criminal. Nobody, nobody in the justice system or the school system cared enough to even ask why I did what I did. Nobody. 